All right, we're on Groaning Storehouse of McMillan. We are playing as Bunny Legion here in the spirit of Easter. We're going to put a little droplet here. We're running our endgame build. Uh, we've taken off the mural sketch. And we've also taken the wrong path to this door. We are running with the... Instead of the mural sketch, the never sleep pills. So we will have a... It just went burst out of the way. Uh, no mother people? Okay. back here all right well on the bright side we almost have our bff sacks already i wonder if they're doing an invocation where's the basement at I feel like we have two no other people purposely because I think they're doing the invocation. And we're running into one of those builds. I don't see anybody. Let's go see if somebody's down here. Oh, no. No, no, no. I know what you guys are up to. I know what you're up to. You're also a sable. I'm not hooking you down here. Let's hope that means you got to start that all over again. So yeah, we're getting a long duration on our frenzy for running the no sleep pills. They still in here? They went out this way? We just can't read scratch marks, confirmed? I don't know where they went. We just need to chain together two hits so we can hit the same survivor twice. Oh, they're in the basement. Well, this is going to come as a rude surprise. <laughs> Look how much time we still have left. Look at all those BFF sacks we got. So the good news is... There is good news that even if they got that invocation finished, 
They are. Ah. Even if the invocation got done, they are just giving. Ah. They're even resisting there. We have got our BFF stacks. We've got three stacks and no way out. Back here. Ah. Oh, they DC. <laughs> ah. Kate on the hook disconnected. The Neo T seed. The no, the no mither, the no mither. Oh my God, that's like our third five hit down. By the way, the Kate is dead. They spent so much time on getting that invocation done, and yeah, this gen's still regressing. They are in. A lot of trouble. Yeah, you guys, you guys aren't even making it to end game. They're stable. I believe this team is not going to make it to end game. I right, see we find Nia. I think she's gonna let her die on hook. No offering for uh. uh what's going on here? <laughs> Come here, Nia. I know you guys had a plan. But boy, this is a. Uh, this is a. Uh, this can't be what you had in mind. Keep thinking that's scratch marks, but that's the hooks. Oh, that's a that's a bot, Nia. That's a Nia bot. No wonder she was acting so weird. The Sable's an actual living survivor. So she, uh, my guess is not is not going to risk herself. I wonder if she went to the basement to heal. You think the Sable had a basement perk? Oh, I see you over there. It's Easter, Sable. What do I do with you? Hmm. All right. In the spirit of the holidays, and since we're a big gargantuan bunny... Let's get you a hatch. We'll get you a hatch. Let's check the usual. 
out of the way places. Not necessarily the fault the Sable DC'd, though she was with the two people who DC'd. I don't know if I want to reward that, but again, it is the spirit of the holidays, Sable. Who knows, maybe you're going for a depth or something. All right, so uh, this match showcased a couple of things and not just the number of blood points we got from that. Wow, that's a lot of blood points. Um, so what did this match showcase? Uh, the Sable was running the Invocation and she may, I, I, I feel like that there was something going on. The, two, the Nia and the Kate obviously were together running the exact same builds, Distortion, Resilience, No Mother and Deja Vu. Um, these are, this is a gen build for when you're injured and this would be a build I would have expected to see the Sable running with the Weaving Spiders invocation because that's going to make you broken if you do it as no, as no mither. Once you do that as no mither, then, you know, maybe the idea was that we were going to get thrown off and not expect the invocation. But just the fact two people were running no mither made me think someone was doing it. As it turned out, Sable and Zarina ended up being down there in the basement. Uh, lots of distortions, four distortions. I don't think that was a coincidence. I don't think they wanted us to be able to see anyone in the basement. But unfortunately, distortion does nothing against killer instinct. So whenever we got somebody in frenzy and we were had killer instinct, we actually saw two people in the basement we'd already found the Sable down there starting the invocation. So we just assumed at that point that Sable had gone back down there to continue the invocation. And we actually found Zarina with her. Lots of stuff, um, again, for, for Jens, uh, the Neo with the brand new part. Uh, the Kate had this, this med kit, which turned out to probably not be of much use. Why, Kate, why are you bringing a Ranger med kit and a syringe I guess to help your teammates, because it certainly isn't helping you with no mother. I, I, I don't know what the, there, there was a plan here, but the two things that illustrated was one, Legion's add-on, the never sleep pills, are actually really good. People think of them as a meme, but increasing the duration of Feral Frenzy by 10 old seconds means your frenzy lasts a long time. And even though you're only moving 4.6 regular killer speed to start, you do get faster as you go along. And just that extended duration of frenzy allows you to chain together hits and to get five hit downs. We got, I think, three of them in the course of this match. And simply because even when we weren't playing the best, even when we weren't looping the best in Legion's power, we still had enough juice in our frenzy to be able to get to the survivors we needed to get to to get those five hit downs. So never sleep pills. Don't sleep on this add-on because it's a good add-on. And the other thing is the invocation is not really a very good perk. It's not worth it. It's too much time investment. They spent time doing that that they weren't doing gens. We had an end game build that never got to end game, partially because people died. You know, Kate died on two hooks, partially because we had multiple DCs once things weren't going their way. But they just wasted a lot of time in that invocation, gave us time to chain those hits, to get those downs, to start getting our no way out stacks. And invocation, not good. The never sleep pills are good. And that's a 3K. Mercy from the Easter Bunny Legion for the Sable.